My name is Travis Lentz, and I'm just going to quickly run through the assembly of one of my conversion kits. Um, because it's difficult to send it in the mail, and because when you install it, you can't have it all connected, um, I do have some color coding to help put this thing together and help disassemble it. So first, I'm going to run through everything. So I've got the two heat exchangers. The first heat exchanger heats the oil prior to the filters, the strainer filter. You always want to filter warm oil. So you'd hook your oil from your vegetable oil tank into here. Um, and like I say, typically it's just a marine style tank. Just hook your hose up to that. And then the oil that comes out of that goes through strainer, filter, um, through my bleed valve where you can bleed the air out. And then it goes down into my three-way valve. So this three-way valve switches between vegetable oil and diesel supply to here. We'll be provided to, provide to here. You need to provide your diesel to there. And then the output on the way to the injection pump comes through second heat exchanger, basically gets warmed up, comes in, comes out, fuel out, and then what I've got is it comes in to a piece of aluminum tube, which has my temperature switch on it, so that detects the minimum temperature and switches to vegetable oil when it's warm. And the final piece of tubing is clear Tigon tube, um, chemical resistant, and this hooks right to your injection pump. This is injection pump. So the clear tubing allows you to see any air bubbles if you've got any air leaks. So what I have done is I've color-coded. See how this is blue? That's blue. So I'm going to have that disassembled. So you just need to hook the colors back up. Blue, blue. This big tube I'll have disconnected, which is marked yellow. And that big tube is basically what you do is you route the coolant in through any one of these, and then it goes out through that one, and then out through another. So that's for running your coolant. And like I say, I'll disconnect this one, which is yellow. I'll disconnect this one, which is red. And then I will disconnect this one, which is green. And this is the control box. This is where you turn it on and on. These are your power leads. Say so this is your temperature switch. We've got lots of wire. And these are the wire for your solenoid valve. Thank you. <laughs>